Alright, so one thing you want to be cognizant of uh, when you're, you're loading your kayak with relation to the, the Torquedo Ultralight is that when you put your gear on there, the placement of the battery, if I were to come down on this right now, you can see this data cable here, I already have it hooked up. Uh, if I come down with my black pack on it, it's going to tug on this data cable. Same thing if I had it far enough, you know, the battery far enough forward, it's going to be yanking on the, the, the motor cable coming out of there. And what that can do over time is it can pull on these IP67 rated waterproof connections. It can damage even the wire inside uh, in a way that you get an E30 error code. So I guess the, the take home message that I have is really think about where you're placing your battery in relation to the rest of your gear. And I'm gonna give this enough slack when I put the, the black pack down, such that you are not putting undue strain where your connections are, whether it's at the battery, up at the throttle, or here at the motor. Uh, a lot of times with years and years of use where people don't really pay attention to it and they get it, you know, maybe they even have it in the up position uh, and they have this motor pinched underneath something and it comes, they lower it down, they don't even see it happening and it, it really pulls on that and it can it can undo this waterproof connection here at the top uh, and then it rains or whatever and and then water gets in and destroys the motor but it starts with an E30 air code and it starts with you not really being aware or, or careful with hey are these is there is there enough slack in each of these lines you know when you lower the motor when you shift gear around are you are you yanking on that so be careful with that and uh your motor will last a very long time